Danny Dyer shocked fans during an appearance on This Morning on Monday as he urged viewers not to watch his new Channel 5 show Heat. The actor, 55, appeared on the ITV daytime show ahead of making his dramatic return to the TV screen following his East Enders exit earlier this year. His new series, which is set to air over four nights from Tuesday, sees Danny portray Steve Cameron, whose drama will unfold as his explosive family secrets come to light during a devastating bushfire in Australia. The TV star has warned viewers that they might struggle to cope with the dark content due to it being even more dramatic than anything he portrayed on East Enders. Speaking to Alison Hammond and Dermot O'Leary, Danny said, It's a nutty bit of work. Channel 5. I got this script and I read it in thought. This is just. I'm going to be straight. I'm here to promote it, but if you don't like dark things, don't go near it. Danny went on to reveal that each episode of the four-part series will end on a more dramatic cliffhanger than the last which fans might find to dark. He continued, It's dark. It's so dark, I was thinking can they put this on the telly. However, Danny, who will star alongside Darren McMullen, Jane Alsop, Pia Miranda and Olympia Valance, said once viewers start watching they will be more and more hooked by the drama. He promised, it's brilliant. It gets so much better. It's not bad, the first one. Danny filmed the new series down under and admitted the weather was not what he expecting and that he couldn't shake the jet lag. He told ITV viewers, I thought I want to fill in the sunshine. And I got to Melbourne and it was raining. There were hailstones. The jet lag I had for 10 days. I couldn't shake it off. In episode one, you can see I'm staggering around. Channel 5's official synopsis of the new show states, heat unfolds to the backdrop of the looming Australian bushfire season when two families, who are longtime friends, venture to a secluded home for a summer vacation. As secrets and lies unravel, it becomes a tinderbox, and not everyone will make it out alive.